Hey there, it's Gail from LMT Resources and the Massage and Spa Success Membership Program. And today I just want to tell you very quickly the one thing, the number one thing that will help to increase your rebooking rate more than anything else. And it is super simple and it is super easy. And that is just to be perfectly and completely honest with your clients about how you think that you can best help them. Do you think that the best way for you to help them is for them to come in twice a week for a while because of the conditions that they have right now? Or do you think the best way that you can help them is for them to get on a regular schedule and to come see you every two to four weeks to maintain work that you've done? So. The main thing that you need to do is just give your recommendations for how often they should come in, what services they should get, what products they should buy and take home with complete honesty and from your heart. So if you have something that you sell in your shop that you really think will help them, go ahead and recommend it. If you think that they need to come back the day after tomorrow, to continue the work that you started to give their body a day to rest and then continue the work that you started then you need to recommend that and tell them why in your professional opinion that's the way it needs to go so if you are being too shy or too scared to really give your recommendations to clients you really need to look at that because it's not about the money it's about you being the professional and giving your professional recommendations you know do you think that your dentist is worried about your pocketbook when he says that your tooth needs a filling no he's not do you think that your hairstylist is worried about your pocketbook when she says you need to come back in six weeks so you don't have black and gray roots no she is not she's telling you what you need to do in her professional opinion that would be best for you and so that's all we need to do for our clients is to put all that money stuff aside, put all that, oh, what will they think of me? Or, oh, I'm, you know, what if they think I'm being pushy or anything like that? Because the truth is, if you're recommending what you think and feel in your heart, then you will not be being pushy. And not everybody's going to do what you recommend, but that's no reason not to say it and to, you know, have that level of professionalism in your um, in your practice and you can do this if you work for yourself if you work for somebody else it does not matter you give your professional recommendations and your opinion if you're unsure then give general recommendations I mean massage is generally recommended at least once a month for ongoing benefits so get used to saying things like that practice saying things even write down some different um, ways to say it and figure out a way that you can get really really comfortable making honest and sincere recommendations for your clients. I would love to work with you personally. Check out my um, membership program on lmtresources.com. That is the place for massage therapists who want to build a business that they love uh, and a life that they love. So you can build your business in your way. Um, I also have a free toolkit if you want to get started with some ideas and some resources. You can check out my um, free business toolkit. So that's all over at lmtresources.com. And I hope that you have a great day. I will see you soon.